Hi friends, previous session I have explained all the basic settings of SAP until GL postings I have shown it to the system. Now I am going to going through with the accounts payable process. I will show the configuration. I am going to show the invoice processing and I am going to show the clearing, invoice clearing and automatic payment process how it works into the SAP. Now we go for vendor account creation. Now we are going to create vendor account group. Click on new entries. My account group is I am selecting MRF1. Account group for MRF1. I can select my required fields, my optional fields in this selection. I am selecting reconciliation account as required for my business. I can select here payment terms. If it is required, I can put as required payment block. So according to my business requirement, I can select this field status options. I am saving it. I have created account group for my vendors. Now I am going to create number ranges for my vendor. I have created so many number ranges previous. I am going to select one of the number ranges now to process vendor master record I am assigning one of the number ranges to my vendor group I am going to select one of the number ranges group I selected I am going to create total limit Company code MRF. I'm going to give 50. It's already exist. I have created earlier. Now I'm going to create vendor master record into the system. MRF. My account group is MRF1. My vendor is Anusha and Co. Address Postwood Road. My own. My vendor city is Bangalore. Country IN and region is and selecting as 10 I selected reconciliation account as mandatory so it's asking for reconciliation account and my sort group I'm selecting as vendor and a payment term I'm selecting immediately I'm activating my double check invoice it will check for duplicate vendor payments with the criteria of vendor number with the criteria of currency with criteria of company code it will check gross amount also it will check reference number it will check invoice date system finds with this combination processing second time that then system shows like it's alert like duplicate invoice processing i have saving my vendor i 
have selected my vendor. Now I am going to configure house bank for my company code. I am creating under MRF company code. I selected new entries house bank my house bank I selected as ICICI and my country is IN house banks recognized mainly with combination of country my bank is IN MRF ICICI 01 bank name ICICA bank my region is 10 bank is street is ITPL city is Bangalore I am giving and the branch is ITPL branch bank is exceeded 10 digits so system is stopping me how to process again now bank name ICSA bank region is 10 street ITPL Bangalore branch ITPL branch saving now I am going to create my bank data account id description i am selecting i say bank my bank account number is i am giving x number alternative account number giving for geo triggering I am selecting ICICI Bank currency I selected as INR. Now data is saved. I have created host bank into my system. I am going to create check lots for my ICICI bank SSA I am going to create check lots now I given check lot 0001 to check lot number 1000 see I check lots for MRF I created check lots now I have to create transaction data for my company code MRF before going to create I have to create number ranges for my vendor transactional data I'm going to create number ranges for my vendor 16 number 1012 I'm giving 2000 if overlaps system won't allow saving it I 
I have created number ranges for my vendor all the document types. Now I am going to select my vendor for my transactional posting into the system. I have changed to my current company code MRF. I am selecting the combination of my vendor selected. My invoice date is 01-07-2016. My reference number is MRF1. And posting data so I am changing to 01-07-2016. And I am going to post with the amount 10,000. I am going to show one expenditure account and I will post into that expenditure account now. I am going to select raw material with a thousand amount under in under invoice. Now I am going to simulate to view my entry. My material is debited and vendor is created. This is the initial entry when an invoice is generated. Now I will show configuration for my automatic vendor automatic payment we can do automate we can do vendor payments with two levels one is by manual processing other one is by automatic by automatic SAP provided several ways one is automatic payment configuration through check processing or DME or wire transfer according to the payment type we have to create the payment method as per the configuration system sap allows for outgoing payments there is several ways this therefore outgoing payment right now right now i am going to show only check generation i am going to select company code MRF and my paying company code as MRF special GLs I am selecting A so for advances also it will select saving it paying company codes MRF minimum amount for incoming payment I am selecting 100 outgoing as I am selecting 100 form I am going to select standard SAP standard. So this is the forms available in SAP. I have selected Germany standard version payment advice note. DME is available. Euro bank transfer is available. Check Germany is available. I am selecting now only check generation. I need form. I 